pronounce it, Luxus Tito, 1967. And it looks... Oh, Bodice, Lind Lind Lindau, Bodice. That must be the uh, place of manufacture. So another German caravan. And uh, let's check this one out. Let's have a look in this one. Oh, yes. They got the bunk beds at the front, kitchen. So we're starting to see a few of these uh, layouts coming through in some of the new stuff that we've been looking at recently. Look at that, I love it, I love the, uh, like I say, it's all about that vision it? and this has got vision at the front and the back. Imagine lying up in bed in there. They're so pioneering. Wow, Trabant with a roof tent. <laughs> Trabant with a roof tent. 1980. Roof tent concept. Yeah, tent on the roof. And they got all these uh, support brackets down onto the uh, chassis of the Trabant. Look at that. Yeah, that wow, it's a little uh, pan overview. And then I can see this one. Oh, they got a big display. Hang on, two seconds before we just get over there. Oh, it's like a magnet, though. It's like a magnet. It is like a magnet. Look at all these caravans, little models they've got in these display. Oh, all the, um, all the Heimer shapes. Look, they got the, uh, the look sort of like, almost like the concept-y style of uh, motor arms. Oh, this is where they. Uh, this, this is how they do it. Like this is how they start like carving the, the clay, get the mouldings. Wow. Oh, they got all the um, materials. They got all the, the handles, light lenses, and here we go. Look, like, just endless amounts of little tiny model caravans. And I'm just loving the shape of this. Look at this capsule. This is definitely a capsule on wheels. <laughs> Look at the street. Oh my goodness me. The roof, like, the vents in the roof. Let's just have a little look through that window. See what we can spot. Just get a different angle on it. To the front. I'm going around the other side by the door in a minute. But uh, let's just have a, uh, this is through the window. Interiors. In a roof. Oh, it's got like a gas light. Gas light. Look at this. Oh, the old cooking pot. In a roof on that. Let's 
trying to get some other angles. <laughs> oh, they got the uh, like the step just drops down. Look at it in here. Look at it in here. Look, the yellow bowl. And sable. God. Wardig War 301, 1970. Again. Look at the shape of this thing. A little uh, sloyd cupboards. It's so aerodynamic. <laughs> anyway, what we're going to do now is I'm going to slide over in this direction. And there's a because it starts to slope down. So you just follow this uh, route around the museum. Oh, I didn't get the uh, on the uh, way through. I uh, I saw this this uh, MZ motorbike, and they had the uh, little uh, car behind it. So uh, we know a little bit about these things uh, with the old motorcycles on the Harley Davidsons and stuff. That's uh, MZ 12558 with this little camping trailer behind it. And how nice is that? Absolutely. So pioneering, so pioneering. Little uh, like grease nipple on there, like just keep it grease, doing it season up. And uh, oh, did we miss this one as well? Did I miss that one? This one here, car cruiser, thirty-two. Cool. God, look at the shape on the back of this thing. Shape. Look at the interior. All the little egg cups, there's shot glasses, there's a coffee or there's a oh, kettles, teapot, saucepans, water containers in the pantry. Look at the front, there's a gas light. Gas, oh, God, look at the carpet. Mad. Another 76. Vib Wefferlinger. Oh, we got some stickers on this one then. And some stickers, he's been to a few places. slope now. Hadi Columbus, 1964. <laughs> Loving the seats. Look at the seats. Lampshade is outrageous. Wow. So look at the outside. And a Renault 62 Renault Daphne on the front. And Daphne. Off the balcony. The Delphin. The Delphin 280 Deluxe 1961 from Bursner. So let's have a look. Wow. Wow. Again. Mass, incredibly big windows, oh, just vision, beautiful table in there. And uh, here we go, this is the early Bursner stuff. Oh man. Look at this. What a great little capsule. And a 57 tallness on the front. So I'm just going to keep this uh, rolling. Deflef's Bedouin, 61. Wow. <laughs> I 
another incredible interior. Wood. Ah, oh, it's a little stove. Been towed. Look at the window. Mercedes Benz 65 Mark on the front. That. Oh. <laughs> right. What's on next? What's on next? Let's have a little. Uh, so we're all on down the ramp. Come on down the ramp. Let's go and have a little gander. Mitsubishi there. Ah. Uh, what's this? A cons? Bit of a concepty. Special mobile. Oh, this is the uh, kids' uh, kinder, kinder play area. Yeah, you've got a little uh, kinder play area in this one. Right, let's uh, press on then. So, Mitsubishi L300. Eighty-two. Oh, this one's been a few places. Look at the uh, big netters on the front of there. Roof box. Wow. Mon uh, Montenegro, Como, Summer Ritz. Yeah, got some history. But there's some places. Oh, my goodness. Oh my goodness. Right, we'll come back to that in a minute, because just behind me, I've just missed this uh, Tabert. 1970 Tabert with an awning on it. And this awning. Oh, look at the awning. The colours. What sort of awning is this? Uh, oh, Himalaya. Himalaya. Look at the colours on this. Oh. Serious, they got their uh, little uh, utensil bags. <sighs> Tabber. <sighs> oh, loving these as well. This is the old school, isn't it? This is old school. Mosquito. Oh, lovely little uh, step. Tabber in Boston here. <sighs> Chess set on the table. What a great idea. Look at that for an idea. Oh my goodness. That is outrageous. It's even got embossment on the table in the front. The sort of quality, oh God. This is what we need to be doing these, these days. Embossment in tables. Seventy-three Schaefer Orion on a Mercedes. Look, got the Mercedes badge on the front, and I'm gonna look. You can see the shape of the headlights, like Mercedes Benz. This door, the win. Oh my, the windows. Wow. So a little look. Oh God, look at this thing inside. Whoa, talking about old school. God, with a rear lounge. Oh, wow. Toilet, the washroom. What a beauty. What a beauty. Look at that little spoiler up on the top of the roof. Wow. Right. This looks like a bigger thing. This is the Heimer Resmobile 550. Let's have a look. Oh, oh this is a can. So this is a motor run. Look at this. Nineteen seventy-three. That is a beastie. You've got air ones on the top. It's a little profile of the front of this thing. Right. I like. Look at, the, look at the detail on the side of here. Mm -hmm. 
It smells incredibly old. And it is. <laughs> and it's probably seen so much life as the bed at the back. On a wooden cabinetry. It's just amazing to think that this is what it was like and how it's like pushed on. But, uh, yeah, coach build. They built this uh, on the back of this Mercedes. This is where it all started, really. Look at this. Lovely. Hartman Fabu, 65. <laughs> Some of these caravans. <laughs> like, I just, like, they're so pioneering. Look at this front, that. Oh, man, it's just so pioneering. Open a window, do you get your cooking on, get your beans on. And the, the size of the lounge in this thing is outrageous. Fabo, the size of the window. <laughs> I want to be in a, uh, see the um, sides, see the sides, it bowls out, give it extra space inside. Right, I'm heading this way, heading this way, because Hybrid Mobile at 74, 660. All right, this is old school motorhome in. It's just like a little uh, arm that sat down. Let's have a look inside this baby. Oh, look at the carpet. Oh, it's groovy green. Oh, no. Oh. Even got that little uh, that bathroom up there with a shower cubicle, bed at the back. Oh, there is so much space in here, though. Space in here. There we go. Okay, what else we got? Airstream. Airstream. This Sovereign, 1969 Sovereign of the Road. And I'm gonna kid you not, this thing is absolutely massive. Uh, nine and a half meters of incredible Airstream caravan. Oh, loving the little clocks at the top there. Oh, little fan on the roof, little electric fan. This thing is the metric fridge, oven. The, this is massive. <laughs> oh my God! This is uh, this is definitely Hotel California, Mo Hotel of California. This one. Oh yeah. Oh yes. Let's have a look at the back. So we get a uh, shot of the back. Sovereign of the road. Look at it. Check out the car. <laughs> oh my God, check out the car. 58 Edsel Ranger on the front. Look at this car. <laughs> oh my God, look at the length of this. Oh, look at the length of this thing. Oh man, this is... Uh, get your kicks on Route 66 without a doubt, innit? Get your kicks on Route 66. Look at the steering wheel. Fuel gauge, you wouldn't want to fill that up now. <laughs> Oh my goodness. On a dark desert highway, cool wind in I'm getting a feeling, getting a feeling. Um, well, I'm just going to get that camera rolling again. 68 Ariba Titan. Feel the mood.
to see what grabs us. What grabs us is there's a lounge at the front and a lounge at the back. And it is dining for God knows so many people. You get, oh my God, you'd have a serious whoops up in here. Sink, burners, cool pop roof. the finish on this Wilk, 69 Wilk, and it is, <laughs> let's get rid of the front, rid of the front, there's Caravan, oh, stunning, love this, uh... oh, finish on it, just goes to show, you know, these vans back in the day were just absolutely built to last, wouldn't they? Well, they probably, people, yeah, they eventually, you know, they just get, get beaten, beaten to death, they get run down, and uh, just only a few survivors come through, but uh, it's, um, it was, it's, it's real nice built stuff back in the day. No Wilk. Okay, camper van time. A Def Lefts 86 Globetrotter. Check it out. Check it out, baby. So basically, you know, it's not a huge amount of years old, but how things have changed. What a lovely, look at a bike rack on the back. A bike rack on here. All in red, roof ladder up on the top, look. Let's have a look inside then. Let's see what the Globetrotter... We were checking out some Globetrotters over at uh, Munich, and uh, they're a little bit different from this now. It's got the old, old Fiat dash on it, look, and... Uh, oh, a few old cassettes on the table, look. Nice. But, uh, yeah, you know, it, it's just all going on all going on lovely absolutely lovely another one starting to look a little bit more uh, like you uh, sort of recognize it Heimer camp 84 and uh, so yeah we got the uh, overhead bed on this one table Got that kind of old veneer on it. <laughs> God. <laughs> it a bit, bit of lino on the floor. Bit of lino there on the floor. Yeah. Got the uh, roof ladder bike back rack on it. A little mooch. Oh, so we got some little uh, protosoibies kind of stuff here by the looks of it. So this is the floating, it's the sea lander that, with a motor on the back. So you can take it land yacht sealander 2015 so these guys yeah just back it in dump it in the sea got kenwood stereo turn up the volume get with the action table in the middle look at this gas burner the windows in the side of this you know <laughs> look at the window sealander how good is that one Through the uh, middle again. The vision. Oh, rip the roof back. Look, it's a rag top. Get it on the. Get it on the lake. Oh yeah, Ariba 81 Eribet. What a beautiful 2 CV on the front. Look at this. Let's have a look at this one then. Oh yes, look at that. What a classic little outfit. Classic. Right, well, I'm just uh, sort of rinsing on round. A little uh, Ariba. Oh, this is a little uh, Puck. 1980 Puck. I used to see a few of these on campsites. The, uh, some really nice old retro ones around. I remember seeing one down at Bergerac, actually. Very similar to this one. Two years ago. 
the camping. There you go, look. Ariba Puck. With a pop roof. How nice. So what's on? We got a bit of a Ariba Future 2001. They got uh, some nice artwork on the side of this. Oh, now this looks interesting. So last night we were actually parked next to, in Garmish, the Niels and Bischoff Clow, and this is an 83 Clowler, Niels, Niels and Bischoff. So that's, uh, and we were talking to the guy this morning, the owner of the uh, Niels and Bischoff, and you have never seen anything. So the quality build of that thing now is incredible. Uh, and he was showing us it was his first actually is he's bought a Niels and Biscoff liner and it's his first motor out. <laughs> We're like, wow, let's have a look. Oh, looks like we might be able to go in here then. Can we go in here? The door is open, so I'm gonna take full advantage and be totally respectful and get in this Niels and Biscoff. And uh, look at this, look back in the day, look, look at the TV. You've even got like a you know back in the day style TV. And uh, they got the overhead bed up here. Let's just, uh, I'm going to come up the front a little bit. Oh, we got a CB radio in here, look. All sorts going on in the front of the cab. And uh, just going rinsing round. There's the old uh, kitchen. <laughs> look at the red. Hey, you know I'm always looking at the size of the sinks. Look at the size of this sink. Look at this. And the tap is outrageous. And the stove, oh, look at this. Do we recognize this, look? Nice little infill as well. Come on, and we're learning, we're learning. We know all about this sort of stuff. Do you know what I mean? Big sinks, um, infills, made of wood, a bit of quality. Look at the, look at the worth. I, I love the, um, the edge on this as well. Look at the edge on the profile. Do you know what I mean? It's, uh, you always get that sort of a situation where, you know, when, you, when you're sort of camping, things like, but look at this. Such a nice profile. Um, into the shot, into the uh, like, fold, I think that's a, a fold up, yeah, fold up sink. I can see the little catches up on the side, so um, fold the sink up, get your toilet under there, like, and fair play. It's a nice old, uh, old toilet there, big walk in shower. So, how nice is that? A Niels and Bischoff, wow. We have a bit of a concept one here, uh, 1993 Heimer concept, and uh. It's looking pretty mad. Um, got some nice little bits and pieces out there. They've got a little Honda and a Pagio scooter. I want to see a full transit down there, don't I? Oh my God, it's all excitement. So it looks like they've got had some sort of futuristic design guy on this one. Oh my God, look at the wipers. Look at the wipers. Look at the wipers. <laughs> Oh, and, and the blade is actually split, so I was just going to say, oh, I don't know where you get them sort of wipers from. But um, the concept, Burstner Grand Panorama sort of concept is uh, definitely in, uh, in amongst this one. Look at the dash on American, the chairs. Oh, look at the chairs. Oh, God. So, uh, yeah, just a very, very futuristic looking thing. Just have a look up the side. Look at the back. That's lovely. Oh, you certainly uh, got a bit carried away with the windscreen on that. I don't, I don't know if you're going to get one of them from Auto Glass somehow. With the mirrors, the mirrors are, you know, the uh, they're starting to, uh, you know, you still use these kind of mirrors. Pagio, well, we got a little Honda Monkey. Carry it around with you, and. Uh, Oh, so it's a 1982 look, Heimer, Heimer car uh, on a full transit. Let's have a look at the front of this transit. Look at that. Look at that. You just forget the shape of this sort of stuff back in the day. Just forget the shape of it. How nice is that? Let's have a look inside this one then. God, I want a back tail lights, look. <laughs> oh my God. The pop roof. 
The pot roof. Wow, look at that pot roof. And a uh, little table. Make up bed in here, that. <laughs> Chairs. Oh, let's just see if we can see the dash on this transit. Oh, look at the dash. Oh, yes, I, remember, I just remember this kind of like styly. So minimal, isn't it? Now, you know, like, oh man, the gear stick, look. God. God. How many times has that clutch been pushed down? The pedal, the pedal rubber looks a little bit worn, and uh, it's made a few gear cat changes, I expect. So probably the last one to look at today is the latest Ariba Touring 2021 caravan, which we were down at uh, the free start in Munich. And uh, I think we actually looked in one of these uh, caravans and was just like blown away with the, uh, how it's pioneered on so far. And they've actually got it shown here at the, uh, the uh, museum. And uh, yeah, we, we saw that window. So uh, it will be in that, uh, the free stat and the uh, the bed up there. We had a we had a good look round it. They're not allowing anybody in these things, which is fair enough. They don't want everybody uh, jumping in there. But um, beautiful car. And there she is again. The front, uh, all that blue LED, all underneath the uh, the trim, all the way down through aluminium wheels and that porthole window. So um, it's just giving it so much like character, Dometic air conditioner on the roof, satellite dish. It's, uh, so uh, give me a nice little overview of the mu museum. And uh, looking around here, it's just so spectacular. Absolutely uh, stunning museum to come. How good is that? Just come into this, so uh, they got like an interactive area uh which is pretty impressive look at this in here <laughs> just uh checking out what i see on my camera yeah so they just they give you this uh, interactive card that you put in a machine and then you can um, check out the areas with all around the world. With your, with your photo. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure what that's all about, but uh, yeah, it just shows you all the uh, interactive pictures of the area, which is really interesting. Right. I'm still just having to play around with this, like we've got Las Vegas. <laughs> Oh, Grand Canyon. Oh, Grand Canyon. Oh, it's all on here, look. Oh, lovely. So you can... Yeah, Western USA. Oh, then what, what happens at the beginning, they give you that uh, little route look, for road, road trips and stuff. Little road trip route. Beautiful cafe here, look. Um, drinks, food, <laughs> gosh, it looks stunning. It's all in the uh, the foyer of the uh, museum here. I'm just going to rip over to the other side. We're just going to have, have a quick look in the uh, gift shop. A little uh, look around their gift shop. And they have got Heimers and uh, books and uh, vans. It's all here. All the little gifts. Oh, little boxes. Oh, look, see, the, uh, these are little lunch boxes, look. These are the lunch boxes, like we got from the Bursoners. Just have a little, uh, we'll just have a little rip around. Land yachting, all the, uh, the parks, road trips, open. Ah, oh, it's all here. Look at this, look. Soulful driving, look. All the, all the incredible routes, secret campsites. Oh, look at this. So nice. It's all here. It's all here. Everything you want. All these little gifts. Wooden trinkets. 